President Joe Biden warning the future of American democracy is at stake in next week's midterm elections. What we're doing now is going to determine whether democracy will long endure. Biden placing direct blame on his predecessor for refusing to accept the 2020 election results, calling that unsubstantiated mindset destructive. This is a path to chaos in America. And he's made a big lie, an article of faith in the MAGA Republican Party. The president's appealing to voters to use their ballots to stand up against election lies, deniers, and violence. We the people must decide whether we're going to sustain a republic where reality is accepted, the law is obeyed, and your vote is truly sacred. But top House Republican Kevin McCarthy on Fox News accusing Biden of dividing the nation instead of uniting it. They just want to distract from the disasters they created. As threats against elected officials surge, President Biden linked the January 6 Capitol violence to the attack on House Speaker Nancy Pelosi's husband Paul at their San Francisco home. The assailant ended up using a hammer to smash Paul's skull. U.S. Capitol Police revealing they have cameras surveying the residents, but that they were not being actively monitored because the speaker wasn't there. Last week, the Department of Homeland Security warned in a bulletin obtained by ABC News that violent extremists could pose a heightened threat to the midterm elections. It should be another wake-up call with respect to the moment that we're in. The alleged assailant who broke into Pelosi's home is due back in court tomorrow on attempted murder and attempted kidnapping charges. M. Wynn, ABC News, Washington.